Hi, this is i1 Studio. Today, I want to show you how to use my project, Base Library, for After Effects. First, you need to install the ZXP installer. The download link is in the text document. Then, install the Atom X extension. If you already have this extension installed, then update it to the latest version. This is necessary for correct work of the package. After installation, restart After Effects. In the Windows tab, select Extensions and then Autumn X. To install the package, drag the .autumn file into the Autumn X panel. Enter your email and activation key. You can find the key in the download section of the videohive.net. Done! Project installation takes between 3 to 5 minutes. You can see all new items by clicking on the corresponding button. You also need to install free fonts. Their link is in the text document. Each item has preview files. Select the element you like and click on the Apply button. If you need to apply a transition, move the slider to the junction of the footage and apply the transition. Ink, brush, elegant, and glass transitions work in a different way. Part of the footage should be overlapped over another. Click on the overlapping part of the footage and apply the transition. To apply the preset, select the text layer and click the Apply button. You can control animation with special controllers. Let's look at the ways to edit elements. You can go inside an element's composition and use the control layer to change various parameters. Use companion layers to change text. To change the media file, use the composition placeholder. For faster customization, use essential properties. The fastest and most convenient might be the Atom X customizer. It allows you to quickly change colors and other parameters.
You can also change the text in it and get quick access to the media placeholder of the composition. For some elements, you can change the speed of the intro and outro animations. Move the markers to control the title animation. Audio jungle. All backgrounds have looped animation. You can use any duration simply by lengthening or shortening the layer. Also, you can change the animation speed by moving the marker. You can change the speed of the transition animation by lengthening and shortening the layer on the left and right sides. For tracking callouts, the first thing you need to do is click track motion in the track window. Set track point to point of interest. Run analysis to generate keys up to the desired point in the video. Create Null Object. Click Edit Target and select Null. Apply Motion Tracker options. Use parent link on callout to null. Adjust the size and position on your callout.
All elements work at any resolution and aspect ratio. When applied, they automatically fit the resolution. If you've changed the resolution of the composition and you need to adapt any element, just click the Resize Items button in the Autumn X toolbar. If you use right or left languages, use a special button to fix possible problems. Use Remove Unused button to delete elements and make the project easier. You can add any item to the Favorites section for quick access. You can combine elements to achieve your own unique result, as shown in the video example. Inside the compositions of some elements, you can observe layers interacting with which you can change the look and style of the element. If you want to duplicate an element and use different visual settings, you may end up changing the settings together on the original and the duplicate. But using essential properties, you can change the properties independently of another element. Use sound effects to make your work more immersive.
you can watch the tutorial directly in Atom X. Thank you very much for watching this video. Good luck and see you again.